Hi everybody, good morning. Happy Monday. It is February 1st, 2021. We made it through the first month of 2021. Woo! Um, it, it seems like this month was a little better than last year, huh? I mean, we had, we had, we did have a, a crazy, uh, riot at our nation's capital and, uh, COVID is, you know, ravaging its way through the country, <laughs> but, uh, I'd say it's been so far, things look a little shinier, but who the fuck knows? It's America. Shit can be switched upside down in, in, in one instance, but, uh. I don't know, man. It's uh, it's going good for me so far, I guess. Um, for those who don't know, obviously I got COVID at the end of December, and I had it all going into 2021 for a couple days. Very mild case, but it was just, it was a weird moment, man. Last year, 2019 to 2020, I got super sick on Christmas, and it was the worst sick I've ever felt going into 2020. And then I got sick literally the same exact day this year with COVID. Or basically the same. Well, actually, no. A few, like a week before. But, uh, yeah, man, it's wild. It's wild to, to think and to, 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 to know that, you know, 2020 was what it was and we are here now. And it's just hopeful uh, for me. I'm trying to be positive. You know, I'm stuck in traffic right now. So, uh, you know, I love it. I love being stuck in traffic. <laughs> I really don't mind it. Um, anyways, I am on the way to work and this, what do I do on these moments, these Monday morning moments? I like talking about the weekends and things I've learned, right? Um, I learned that I, and I learned again, I got like another reminder that alcohol, although it is a poison, although it is a kryptonite, if I call myself Superman, which I never do, but Anyways, alcohol is a is a weakness of mine. Although it is not the main cause of all my problems and I need to quit thinking that. I learned that a lot of the shit that I ble- like be- beat myself up for when I'm drinking is shit that I, I do sober. Awkward things I say, overzealous conversation, rambunctious energy. That's just who the fuck I am. And I think because I was you know, I felt so judged by it and I felt embarrassed by it because I did fuck up a lot. And, you know, I've had really, really traumatic, embarrassing moments in my life. I think that my social anxiety got 10 times worse. And I think that I kind of wanted to look for a straw man to yell at. And that became alcohol. And yeah, it was just, I guess this weekend was just another reminder that even if I drink responsibly and I'm okay, I'm still that same guy, you know? I, um, and I don't give a fuck. I have to really tell myself, I just don't give a fuck about being myself. I just can't and don't and won't. And being myself is having deep conversations with people I care about. Being myself is giving advice to people who I think need it with no judgment. And that's just who I am. So... I don't know. The last few weekends, I guess, I've learned that uh, life is weird and you can get confusing, but the best thing you can do is just hold on to the confidence in yourself and remain yourself. That's it. Remain yourself. Find yourself and then remain yourself. Dr. Dre always said, you know, it's easy to, to, to get it. It's harder to keep it or some shit like that. I don't know if Dr. Dre said that or somebody said some shit like that, but yeah. <laughs> So yeah, man, I'm good. I'm feeling really good. It's Monday morning. I'm on the way to work. Stuck in traffic, but it's all good. Gonna have me a little smoke here. Where's my smoke? My smoker. Here's my smoker. They have nobody in this live at all. I love it. Too early for everybody, I guess. So yeah, man. Good day. Good day. <coughs> <laughs> Tomorrow we're doing the podcast on um, Matthew McConaughey's new book called Green Lights. 
very excited about that. And yeah, man, I guess I don't have much else to say. Just find yourself and keep yourself. Stay confident. It takes a long time to understand what's your fault and what's not. What's just a part of your personality and what's not. What are you doing from the goodness of your heart? And what are you doing from the selfishness of your ego? These are things we learn as life goes on. And I think that, you know, with self-reflection and shit like that, it can get confusing. But then there's another layer to it you find where it's not confusing. And it's a lot more solid, I guess, or consistent. Um, But yeah, I don't know. Just give it time. And it starts making sense a little bit. Don't get me wrong. It gets confusing still. But after a while, it starts making sense a little bit. So, yeah, man. I hope you guys are enjoying these 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 videos. I really enjoy making them. Um, this is the first time I've ever gone live on Instagram. And I don't think anybody popped up. But, you know, it is what it is. It's fucking 630 in the morning. <laughs> um, I love you all. I hope I can get to work today. It looks like I'm literally in uh, stop in, in stopped traffic. So, yeah, man. I love you guys so much. You guys have a great fucking weekend. Um, mind control tomorrow. I'll have another trip story, hopefully, in, towards the end of the week for you guys. And uh, if you haven't seen it yet, there's a new trip story video out right now that I just uploaded um, about this guy who does salvia and then ends up peeking in the ocean and almost dies. Uh, it's sick. <laughs> it's actually a really good trip story. So check it out. YouTube.com slash Audible 44. Uh, or you guys are probably already watching this on the account. So sorry it's so dark. Still love you guys. Still balling. Still DRE. Peace out, guys. <laughs>